Please be seated. This morning, we welcome Christopher and Amy, who are bringing their daughter, Anna Claire, before the Congregation for Christian Baptism. Joining them and standing as sponsor to Anna Claire is Elizabeth Allen. And assisting me this morning is Deacon Frank Hard and Deaconess Carolyn Killian. Welcome, everyone. Now you have brought your child here, desiring for her Christian baptism, which is the sacrament of cleansing and of entrance into the love and care of the Church of Christ. This is a service of thanksgiving as we offer to God the gratitude of our hearts for the hope and happiness which come into our lives by the presence of a child. It is a recognition of God as the giver of life and a testimony that all children are his. This service also is one of dedication and consecration. The dedication of your child to God and your own consecration to new and holier fidelity that you may give to your child the best that you have learned of the ways and love of your heavenly Father. Now open your hearts and minds to hear these inspired words of scripture from the book of Acts. Repent and be baptized every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for the forgiveness of your sins and you will receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. The promise is for you and your children and for all who are far off, for all whom the Lord our God will call. May God add his blessing to the reading of his holy word. Christopher and Amy, do you promise to instruct this child in the word of God and by example to bring her up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord, to teach her the principles of our Christian religion, to pray with her and for her, and to bring her up in the fellowship of the church? Betty. Do you who stand as a sponsor solemnly engage to strive diligently to hold up the hands of these parents in the fulfillment of their covenant, that this child be instructed in the word of God, brought up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord, kept in communion with the church, and strengthened to live in a godly manner all the days of her life? Now do you, the members of this church, as of the whole Church of Christ, receive this child into your love and care, and do you promise that so far as you are able, you will uphold and encourage the parents in the fulfillment of their covenant? May we bow in prayer. Gracious God and our Heavenly Father, we ask that you look upon these, your servants, that they may live out and uphold the vows and promise that they make before you, and that your blessing be with them and upon young Anna Claire, who is now to be baptized in your name and to the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. In his name we pray. Amen. Now it is recorded in the 10th chapter of the second gospel that Jesus said, Let the little children come to me, Forbid them not, for such is the kingdom of God. And taking them up into his arms, he laid his hands on them, and he blessed them. And what do you name this child? Anna Claire. I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Will the congregation kindly rise? <laughs> now we stand here together with you in the sight of God to say that we recognize this child as a child of this church. And so then we'll join you in our prayers and in our conversations that at an early age, she might become the inward subject of that outward side of the symbol she now receives. May we bow in prayer. Gracious God and our Heavenly Father, we lift high
high before your throne of grace, and I pray, asking that you would bless her ears, that she should ever hear your word, her eyes, that she might see your hope, and her lips, that she should sing forth your praise. Now the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May the Lord lift up the light of his countenance on you and give you peace now and forever. Amen. <laughs> what a good girl. Because she likes me so much, she had too vocal about that. <laughs> Please be seated. I told them I'd get a smile out of her before this morning was out, but I'm not so sure anymore. 